result. But mm -hmm. you've got to admit that Burnley were dreadful. Um, yeah. But they came flying out the box. Oh, I'll start again. I don't know what I'm talking about. Let me start again. Okay. No, I'm saying. Being really positive, um, of course, Elliot Hodge. Um, <laughs> so, uh, Elliot. Joe, what have we got going down at Warsaw today? In today's Express and Star, we've got lots of... Sorry, just keep going then. Don't ask me a question, I'm blaming you for that one. You ready? They played, and the boss admits he is considering tinkering with his... Oh. <laughs> I don't know what I was saying, I thought I was going so well then, as soon as I was winging it. Don't get that in. <laughs> <laughs> no. It appeared to be pretty one-sided uh, from what the Liverpool... Oh, Why? I don't want to say that. I don't want to say that. A loss on Saturday is like... Oh, sorry. Oh, sorry. Man, no. Hello, I'm Nathan Judo. I'm here with Matt Mayer. Matt, uh, four home wins in a row, seventh in the table, Salomon Rondon hat-trick. Happy days. Four home wins in a row. Four. Three. Is it? Oh, it's OK. It is three. <laughs> is that... What do we do with that way? Hmm. Should we go with that, do you reckon? I don't mind. Okay, let's the, go with uh, that. Or treating tonight? Well, maybe. It'll be a bit late, wouldn't it, by the time we get back? Get but, back yeah. at half eleven. I've got my little outfit. Been. Got my little outfit. What do you reckon? That is what are you doing? It's the wolf. Shocking. It's the that wolf. Is shocking. Why? That's terrifying. <laughs> <coughs> one one today for all the post match reaction. Make sure you log on to expressandstar.com. <laughs> Speaking afterwards, Walsall boss John Whitney said he felt it was a point gained. Ah, oh, sorry. With just four games now of the season remaining. I don't know what I'm saying. I don't know what I'm saying. Game that certainly was with Walsall showing some real battling qualities to make sure they didn't lose the game. A same point again. Same I don't know what I'm saying after that. Do you want to just carry on through that bit? No. Are you sure? What am I saying? As long as I do it in one take eventually, that's alright for you, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. It's only five right. minutes a yeah. day if yeah, I take. So yeah, yeah. Following a performance in which I said, ah, oh, f off. I don't know what I'm saying. I don't know why I'm dying here. I'm dying. Their four remaining games, they will be promoted automatically. Hello. Okay. That was alright as well. Yeah, that's good. How long was it? Um. Today on the Express and Star, he's called for Wolves' players to stand up and be counted uh, as they look to end their nine-game winless. Oh my God! Uh, but there is there's Oh God, sorry, sorry, mate. Right. Let's carry on. Yeah. Back in 2014, um, if if they want, if oh my God, what's wrong with me? So that perhaps bodes well if you're looking for some. Oh my God! Oh my God! What's wrong with me? This is the worst I've ever been. Of course, he missed Saturday's game of youngster Harry Burgoyne coming into net. Yeah, let's go again. As Lambert talked about, he talked about Joe Mason, Lee Evans, and also Prince Odom. Onyege. 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 I was going to say Odom Wingy. Prince Odom Wingy. Was Joe Mason, Lee Evans, and also Prince. Onyege. I can't say it. Can you see a little oh, stadium? Oh, yeah. Huh? You can see a bit of blue, blue banter here. Looks quite quite cute. You're gonna make a light scot out on Wolves' faint promotion. Oh, I like it, I like it. Okay, okay, okay. Hello, I'm Nathan Judo. I'm here with Wolves reporter Tim Spears. Tim. Excellent news. One one here at St Andrews for all the post-match reaction on this one. Make sure you log on to expressandstar.com. Yeah, decent mate. Decent yeah. mate. Yeah, that was alright. That. So, so it's not